everyone, welcome to this round two from the 401 release tournament for Age of Ascension in Keyforge. I'm Travis. I'm Sung Ho. Uh, and thanks for joining us. Uh, so we've got two new players up this uh, Benson and Jay. Uh, Jay actually runs a lot of Keyforge events uh, at, a, at another venue in the city. Uh, every I think they do it Tuesday nights. Uh, Benson leads off with an Umbra. So, familiar card from yep. Call of the Archons. Just deciding how he's going to respond. We got a... So we got a poke. So one damage to a creature, uh, gain an amber, and if you kill the creature, then you get to draw a card. Right. Then follows it up with... Looks like it archives a card. Sloppy lab work. And then... Discard a card to archive a card. Yeah, it's like arch I think it's archive a card and then discard. Oh, that's cool. I, I can't remember if it's discard two cards or discard up to a number of cards. Oh, I like this one. Our card and discard, yeah. The, the, uh, artif uh, the untamed artifact. It, like, uh, turns a turns a character yeah, a losing, is elusive, and uh, taunt. Niffle grounds, of course. Yeah. And then we got some... Hi Ooh, Hippo. Yeah, we got a... Ooh, Nox, so it's got, got a Ross pretty Nar. good board on Benson's side here. Yeah. Uh, Jensen yeah. doesn't have that much developed yet. So looking at some additional uh, power counters uh, for Nox. So get three for each friendly creature. So it's getting six, six for power. Huh. That's neat. That's a, a big boy now. That's pretty cool. We got Sanctum. With so Evan the Armorsmith and then Prince Ar Derek, Derek. So other friendly creature gets plus one armor, and then Prince Derek gain three if you control creatures from three different houses. He doesn't. So how do you? Oh, that's cool. Yeah. <clears throat> then Lion uh, plus two power to his neighbors. Also, new uh, ability deploy means he can deploy it anywhere Just in the battle it line. In anywhere, yeah. Less relevant for this turn, but. So an extra armor uh, for each character and extra power. Mm -hmm. Still going to get chomped by the Nox on Benson's side. Huh. That hippo is hungry. Hungry, hungry. Hungry, hungry I, hippo. <laughs> I guess I never quite made that connection. <laughs> so probably pick Untamed, I guess, to try to knock off some of these uh, Well, it depends if he wants to continue building his board. It doesn't look like he has a lot of Untamed yeah, cards in his this hand. This is a lot different from our previous round where like just kept picking one house and it's nice that like you just want to try to set up yeah, yeah get some different things so that uh you're not stuck to using one house but i mean the other round it was very looks like he's going with shadow, shadow. With yeah yeah <clears throat> oh no fighting sorry oh no, it's a steal. Sorry. i see My bad. cool uh skirmish so it takes no damage right so it just slaps it yeah, yeah. uh ronnie uh or fucking wrist clocks. I forget his last name. Steal one, or if he has a lot, steal two. That's nice. Yeah, it's a, a bit of a pain. Yeah. I think, is it with the... Yeah, it's Benson's deck with a bunch of bad pennies, so... Life for life. Uh, sacrifice a friendly creature to deal six to uh, an enemy creature. Wow. Just cup curse uh, Oh. What's up? What? Oh, six. No. Yeah. Oh, because yeah, he was not giving himself plus one power. Yes, it's others. Yeah, so because he, he had the extra shield. Yes. So I thought yes. if he had the extra shield and the extra power. Right. Uh, going light? back over to Jay. Blinding light, stunning all non sanctum creatures. Wow. Or oh, no, name a couch, sorry. Yeah. Okay. So named uh, Untamed. I think that was in uh, Call of it the Archons, right? Yeah. Well, Untamed now is a little less attractive. I mean, it's not bad if you want to just, like, try to unstun these characters. Sure, but if you're not accomplishing anything course, else with your turn, of course, then... Of course, of course, of course. I, I, think I see a lot of these cards in his hand. I think that might be what he's considering. Might be not bad going back to Shadow and just, like, kill off this, uh, the Armorsmith. I, I think this is all dictated by your hand at this point. Yeah. Looks like three Ds, a couple untamed card. Mm -hmm. Yeah, looks like we're going to untamed to try to clean them up. Looks Soldiers like. to flowers. 
So purge each untamed from each untamed for each discard pile. Right. Gaining one. So just playing it for the amber. No uh, creatures in this discard. So. Mm -hmm. So we're going logos this time with Kita the researcher. Yep. The elusive Fila, sure. and then the and when someone has played adjacent, draw a card. So oh, that's a cool. for playing the researcher, and researcher also lets him archive the top of his discard or his deck. It looks like he uh, discard a uh, archive the top of his deck. Mm -hmm. so I see a lot of people just uh, archiving the the top card of their deck from that when it seems yeah. like you have some real chances to. Wow. Uh, pull something. Um, <coughs> oh, bouncing, bouncing death quark. Yeah. Trading creatures. So it gets rid of the Nox and uh, the, the weird looking yeah. bug thing. Ross Nauer. Yeah. Well, Jay's a bit behind on Amber, but relatively even on board state at the moment. Yep. That was a pretty strong turn. You like Benson just tries to check untamed to get rid of it, and then he responds yeah. with setup of his own. And got value out of those creatures yep. before he was able to mm -hmm. be, before he sacrificed them. Yeah, like that. That Nox did not get a single attack in, which was so big. goes with these. Uh, plays a scallion when he plays. He has to sacrifice a friendly creature, so it gets rid of Umbra. Yeah. Then we got it looks misery good. exploit. Yep. Gain one for each damaged enemy creature. So one creature gets an amber. Yep. Oh, we get to check. Tell the weak. Destroy. To destroy the least powerful enemy creature. Gets rid of the armor smith that way. Also is in check with seven amber. Might be considering going sanctum, it looks like. Checking out his archive. <laughs> so I, I'm guessing you'll continue to resist the urge to buy any uh, Keyforge Sanko? No, sir. Unless FFG sends you a free deck again, you're no. not going to get into it? No. I uh, I don't think I'm still getting used to the, the game enough. Yeah. I think that's the... It's that card from Call, so, Custom Virus, yeah. <laughs> Zorg. Ender play stun. Uh, ooh. Wow. So it stuns whoever it fights and neighboring creatures. Mm -hmm. Benson forges a key. Thies again. Schuler, old favorite. So steals a, stole, stole an amber. Uh, then plays poltergeist. So uses the artifact, which just causes it to be destroyed. That's not bad, it's just so that you don't... Uh, they don't get the ability to use it. Yeah. I mean, huh? Odd. You know, just double check. They don't have any card in the same house. Oh. So, oh, he's gonna purge. Oh wow. Oh wow. He Human. gets rid of a bad penny. So, very effective <laughs> move to clear that shadow creature by purging mm -hmm. the bad penny in his hand. Mm -hmm. And it looks reap. like he's gonna reap. Yeah. Alright, yeah, Jay's just definitely playing from a little behind at this point. Still, interesting, still that he's uh, going for that archives. Yep, go Mars, get Clears rid of the it. Stun. Storm Crawler? Yep. So only deals one when fighting. Uh, but after cr enemy creature reaps, stun it. So that's oh, a pretty that is cool. good disincentive. And it looks like a Galaxy Proliferator. Yeah. It's on a flank. When you reap, you can archive a Mars card from your discard pile. Neat. Oh, that's pretty nice. That's big because, like, G's got, like, two really good Mars creatures. So he's probably yeah. going to pick Mars next turn. But then, like, Benson might want to pick these to try to kill them. Maybe. But yeah, uh, if you've got any these cards in your hand, uh, going these and kind of clearing one of these creatures, some of these creatures off, is yeah. probably a good idea. 
They're going to be very disruptive like, to whatever board you fought, you try to build. But like, it looks like it's thinking better than Stormcrawler, but yeah. oh, Untamed Glimmer. So it's Alpha. Return a card from your discard pile to your hand. So interesting. He's going to spend his whole turn on this. Oh, it has to be the first card, right? Sorry. I, I just yeah I it's the uh, I always see the shadow uh, where it's both alpha and omega it's the only card that you play. Oh, we got some camouflage. Camouflage. So creature not on a flank cannot fight this creature. So that's just Zorg right now. Whoa. Okay. Does it have skirmish? Oh, it must have skirmish. It has assault. So assault just just it deals damage before, before the fight. Before you fight, I see. So what is it? Assault three. Then? So he'll bring it up. I don't know oh, it is assault two, three. It is assault three. What oh, is assault three? That okay. is super cool. Oh, it's also hazardous. So it has the same effect if it's being attacked. Oh, we got. It looks uh, like something shield. Hollow shield, nice. Yeah, hollow shield for the remainder of the turn. The chosen creature can copy dealt damage. Wow. Okay. I don't know if that's going to be super meaningful since it's not in the same house. But. S uh, Strike? Might. Ready and fight for the friendly creature. Deal yep. two to the attacker's creatures. Oh, wow. So, smote with uh, Zorg, dealing two damage as well to the neighboring creatures. What do you fight? Oh, sorry, he fought the, the D's creature, yeah, okay. Close up, blinding light, I guess. I guess we're picking D's, yeah. yeah. Just stun them all. That's a pretty effective turn from Jay. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we got some shadow Whistling action. Darts. So Poison deal darts? one to each enemy creature. Wait, how does it kill that? It kills that? Uh, I'm not entirely sure how it ended up killing his own Oh, creature. he's sacking his own. Wait. For what? what? Oh, light. Oh. And damage goes straight through armor? I guess so. Get rid of all these pennies. Yeah. No, I saw that, but, but I still uh, don't know why his untamed creature died. Yeah, because I... I thought poison darts is just to your enemies. No, no, before. So he sacked it. it. Bad Penny yeah. went for that. Yeah. Gotcha. Whoa. Mar. Mer something? Merkins. Yeah, it looks like he takes creature control of a creature from the. Random card? Ooh. Random card from archives or top card of his opponent's deck. I don't know if he played it from his archive or not. Oh, that is cool. So you just got the. That's cool. Just got a random. Well, I, just, I knew there was one of them in his discard as well. Yeah. Oh, nice armor smith off of that. Yeah. So that puts uh, an armor on each of Benson's yep. creatures. Yeah. D uh, he may have done the whistling darts to each creature instead of each enemy creature, but. I mean, it only hurt. It only hurt him. Yeah. No, but then like he didn't put it on his these creature. So he I he think... has the shields. Oh, it does have shapes. Okay, cool. We got something bot, helper bot. Oh, nice. Ooh, with the Zazrix, the, the harvester, harvester again. Yeah. Just reap, gaining additional one you reap. Cannot be used if it doesn't has a non Mars neighbor. neighbor. Oh, <laughs> that is interesting. Uh, our communities are like. All right, gives its neighbors destroyed. Uh, they get archived this creature. That's cool. Oh, there's that neutron shark. Okay. So what is he uh, destroying? So he discard his own card. Yeah. Destroy. Got to destroy one of his creatures. Yeah. So helper bot goes by, but it gets archived yep. because of. So we're gonna discard the top card. It's a non logos. Okay, it does it again. Yep. And then we'll do it one more time. And it's over. Would have actually been nice to Draw, archive, yeah. well, archive the neutron shark yes. itself. 
with uh, just I guess he had the option to choose it too, oh. but yeah, I guess he could have uh, bounced Zorg as well at that point mm -hmm. and archived him. Benton forges the second key. Jay needs to start catching up here on the uh, Amber side. Do you go just go maybe go Shadow and just try to kill? Uh, I guess you don't want to. Ooh, Does yeah. go Shadow, Dusk Runner on uh, Merkins. So Reap, you also steal one. Oh, nice. So then, might as well fight the shark. So that goes back to hand. Might as well fight Zorg as well. I guess you can finish Zorg off, yeah. Yeah. Ah, we can reap instead. Ooh. Night Forge. Basically, just getting the amber. Let's you forge if you've not forged a key of the turn, you can spend uh, plus four. Well, ten, assuming it's at a yes. six cost. Huh. Well, that's a lot of cards in archives. Yeah, I think, but I think it's a mix of houses, so it's may not be that punch that he really wants. Yes. Though it does look like he has a reasonably strong logos. I don't know. Looks like he's got a pretty even mix in his hand, actually. Yeah, two Mars. Looks like a couple Sanctum and looks like yeah. Does he have one, two, few cards? Yeah, it looks like he only has five. Huh. Maybe we missed something from the previous turn. Yeah. All right. So looks like he's pulling the trigger yeah. archives. It's time. They're not sure what house he's called yet, but maybe looks like it's gonna be Mars. Mother gun. Huh. Yeah. Quite, can't quite use the mother gun yet. Gotta True. wait till it's in play. He's trying to take a shot, but oh, the what's it? Six finger. Okay, cool. Plus one armor to each enemy creature, uh, other Mars creature. Mm -hmm. Then we fight. I think with a penny. So it's each other. So it also affects your enemy, but not won't matter in this match. But then the armor saves it, so that's nice. Detective analysis. Oh, cool. Huh. From archives, interesting. So not from, uh, okay. All right. Didn't really gain any uh, amber this turn either. No. It's but at least need... it stops Benson from trying to just reap and then oh, yeah, steal but... the remaining. So we got... So choose and discard a card from your hand when you play it. Okay. Cycles out one of those bad pennies. Anguish. One of my favorite new cards. Oh, yeah. Anguish is increases the cost of your enemy to forge a key uh, by oh. one for every point of damage on it. Yep, and then we got the last amber ready to for next turn. Yeah. You're not finished with you, let's you shuffle shuffle any creatures you want in. Huh. That's neat. I don't know that I I don't know like it's tempting just to shuffle shuffle everything in. But you I would really just go for one house. Like you wanna make sure that your draw yes. is improved. Just mixing in a bunch of more creatures I don't know is the best uh, use of the card. Doesn't have enough amber to use Cutthroat Research. So, so gotta did get the one amber off the not finish with you, so he is in position to forge a key next turn. So uh, Unless Jay is able to do something about it. Uh, there's nothing know, on his board that is going to stop it. I know there's a few Sanctum Guards that allows you to capture, I think. Yep. But I don't know if... Uh, oh, Pig and Logos. Uh... By Rupture, nope. each player gains no, just... Amber in their pool. I, I think he's just showing the cards that don't matter anything into this match. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, so, yeah. Okay. All right. That's the game. Uh, good game by both players.
uh, Jay had a tough time finding cards to to get up and running. Yeah. Like and that neutron shark was helpful, trying to get a bunch of stuff, yeah. and then it just the death quark did a lot, but it, like none of it was ge generating amber or stealing. Yes. So, yeah. uh, while it was helping to control the boat's board state, it didn't advance his game beyond that, and wasn't really slowing Benson down, at least not from generating amber. Right. 